Beyonce Knowles Carter, popularly known as Beyonce, needs almost no introduction. She's an American pop star, singer, dancer, and fashion icon. Not only does she have killer looks and voice to match, she's one half of a power couple who had been ruling the music industry for decades. Even people who don't know her as a performer may recognize the Beyonce name from fashion labels, cosmetic lines, and Pepsi commercials. It also doesn't hurt that she has an estimated net worth of 450 million US dollars, according to Forbes. In 2008, Beyonce married famous rapper and businessman Jay Z, and soon the power couple became pop music's first billionaire couple. Together, they have an insane combined wealth of 1.5 billion US dollars, courtesy of the Illuminati. Ha ha ha! Don't fool yourself, my friend. Beyonce has worked day and night to build her incredible wealth, and she surely knows how to spend it. Queen B, as her die-hard fans call her, is known to indulge in multi-million dollar mansions, luxury vacations, yachting adventures, and beauty treatments. She is also an excellent gift giver, having gifted her husband Jay-Z a private jet and a car. She also gave her daughter Blue Ivy a doll worth five figures on her birthday. So how did a common girl from humble backgrounds manage to captivate millions of fans and build her stupendous wealth and fortune? And what does she like to spend her money on? Well, make sure to stay to the end of this video as we break down Beyonce's net worth and incredible lifestyle. But before we get into all that, don't forget to press the like button and subscribe if you are new here. With that out of the way, let's begin. Beyonce began her career as the lead singer of the rhythm and blue group Destiny's Child one of the world's top-selling girls group in the late 1990s. After a few years of success in October 2001, Destiny's Child announced that they were going on a hiatus to further pursue their solo careers. Shortly after, in July 2002, Beyoncé made her film debut, portraying Foxy Cleopatra in the movie Austin Powers in Gold Member. Then in 2003, Beyoncé released her first ever studio album, Dangerously In Love. The lead single of the album Crazy In Love featuring Jay-Z quickly become a hit and topped many charts including the Billboard Hot 100 and in the process becoming Beyonce's first number one single. In 2006, Beyonce released her second album B-Day which followed the success of her first album and immediately topped the Billboard 200 chart. In April 2008, Beyonce married Jay-Z and just a few months later in mid-November, her chart studio album was released and besides mediocre reviews and debuting at number one in the Billboard 200, the album included the hit song Halo. Because of the album, Beyoncé also received 10 nominations at the 52nd Grammy Awards in January 2010. It was at the event that Beyoncé made history by winning 6 of the 10 nominations, becoming the only female artist to ever achieve that. Beyoncé's fourth studio album was released in June of 2011 and it was called Four. The album became the singer's fourth consecutive album to land at the top of the Billboard 200. After the release of the album in January 2012, Beyoncé gave birth to her daughter Blue Ivy Carter and went on a short hiatus. June 2012 marked Beyoncé's first appearance after giving birth at the Ovation Hall in Rebel Atlantic City. After a successful comeback and a history-making performance at the Super Bowl in February 2013, Beyoncé embarked on her first tour since giving birth, the Mrs. Carter World Tour. The concert tour included 132 days, running from April 2013 to March 2014, and became the singer's most successful of her career as well as one of the most successful tours ever, raking up a massive 109 million US dollars. The Run 2 tour in 2018, which is a follow-up of the Run 1 tour in 2014, with her husband also grossed a massive 250 million US dollars, making it the highest grossing tour of all time. She was also paid a whopping 3 million US dollars to headline Coachella. In 2019, Beyoncé released her concert film from her Coachella performance on Netflix. Beyoncé's deal with the streaming platform is said to be worth over 60 million US dollars. Music is not the only money maker for Beyoncé. In fact, a large chunk of her net worth comes from non-music related ventures. Beyoncé is a businesswoman who has multiple strengths of income. Beyoncé makes extra money from her clothing brand, fashion, endorsements, touring, film, TV, and more. In 2012, Beyoncé signed a 50 million US dollar deal with Pepsi, where she starred in a commercial during the Super Bowl. Not to mention her other lucrative endorsement deals with lucrative companies like Nintendo DS, L'Oreal and American Express. She also set up on-demand vegan meal delivery service 22 days in nutrition. In 2016, Beyoncé launched her active wear line Ivy Park with Topshop and her fragrance hit made $75,000 in sales in its first day. 
the star has reportedly sold 400 million US dollars worth of fragrance. By the way, if you want to check out Beyonce's incredible quality line of fashion wares and fragrances, then make sure to check the links in the description section below. She also featured in a Jojo Armani fragrance ad and launched a Tommy Hilfiger's fragrance through Star, which she got paid 250,000 US dollars for. Beyonce also makes a lot of money from movies. Beyonce was reportedly paid 12.5 million US dollars for her role in the iconic Dreamgirls film. In 2019, Beyonce was the voice of Nala in Disney's remake of The Lion King, and she got paid a mind blowing 25 million US dollars for her role in the film. She also made the soundtrack of the movie, which garnered in another 2 million US dollars. Beyonce also owns significant equity in Tidal, a music streaming service owned by her husband Jay Z, which is reportedly worth 600 million US dollars. With so many varied income sources, Beyonce is America's 51st richest self made woman in 2020, according to Forbes. Like many millionaires, Beyonce invests in real estate. She and Jay Z spent a lot of time in the Hamptons. They used to rent an estate there for $400,000 a month before swapping it for a waterfront house rental that cost $500,000 a month. In 2017, they finally purchased a vacation home there for nearly $26 million. US dollars. It's next to the exclusive Georgica Pond and comes with neighbors Steven Silberg and Russell Simmons. The same year, they paid $88 million US dollars for a new mansion in Bel Air with a $52 million mortgage. This mega luxury mansion features 8 bedrooms. 11 bathrooms, 4 swimming pools, 1 basketball court, a garage for 15 cars, several staff quarters and bulletproof window. The inside of the house is full of high-tech devices. For example, the automatic glass wall which can be controlled with a remote button. This house was reportedly the most expensive sale of 2017 in Los Angeles County. When Beyonce was pregnant with twins Rumi and Suri, she rented a villa in Malibu for $500,000 a month from which to enjoy her maternity leave. The villa recently sold for roughly $15 million. Beyonce also owns a converted church in New Orleans, which she and Jay-Z reportedly bought for $2.6 million. US in other real estate moves, Beyonce had reportedly bought a $5.9 million Houston property for her mother, as well as Charles Former's home in Malibu for roughly $40 million. She also recently sold her New York City condo for nearly $10 million. US but Beyonce doesn't spend all her time at her parts. She and Jay-Z often vacation in the Dominican Republic, where they have stayed at a $19.5 million at 5,000 square foot estate. They also frequently visit Paris, where they stay in a penthouse at Hotel IE Muris for $20,000 a night. That's not to mention their vacations to Hali, Ibiza and Brazil. But her most lavish vacation was arguably on board Super Yacht Galactica Star, worth $73 million, US dollars, which cost roughly $900,000 a week to charter. In 2017, Beyonce and Jay-Z kept it a little more low-key, celebrating their anniversary in the Grand Canyon. We don't know what Beyonce gifted Jay-Z for their anniversary, but we do know she's generous. She gave him a $2 million Bugatti Veyron for his 41st birthday, a $40 million Bombardier Challenger 850 private jet, and a $500,000 Sapphiring after Blue Ivy's bath. Beyonce looks and dresses her best not just at the red carpet, but for her dates with Jay-Z. They are often spotted courtside at NBA games, which can cost anywhere from 4 to 6 viewers depending on the game. Beyonce also knows how to wine and dine. She and Jay-Z reportedly spent almost $100,000 on drinks for VIP guests at an Atlanta nightclub, and they have dined at the finest restaurants, such as Le Cirque in New York. When she's not dining out, Beyonce still splurges on food-related costs at home. She reportedly spent $7,500 a month for a live-in chef and $4,000 a month for a dietitian. But Beyonce doesn't just indulge for herself and Jay-Z, she also splurges on her children. She reportedly gave birth to Blue Ivy in the exclusive batting suit at Lenox Hill, which cost $1,700 a night. It was decked out with four big screen televisions and room service. And for Blue Ivy's first birthday, Beyonce gifted her an $80,000 diamond encrusted Barbie doll at the $104,000 birthday party she threw for her. Beyonce also spreads the wealth around outside of her family. She recently announced she's donating $100,000 to four historically black colleges and universities. Beyonce also donated a lot of time and money towards natural disaster relief. A native Houstonian, she served meals and made a monetary donation in the aftermath of Hurricane Harvey. After Hurricane Katrina, she founded Noel's Terminus Place apartment for those displaced from the storm. She reportedly had given at least $7 million to keep it running. 
Her own charitable organization, Be Good, does everything from funding scholarships and working with UNICEF to fighting for gender equality and raising money for natural disasters. In April 2020, Be Good partnered with Twitter founder Jack Dorsey to donate $6 million to mental health efforts during the coronavirus pandemic. On one Christmas, she and Jay-Z went to Walmart and bought everyone in the store a $50 gift card for a total of $27,000. So far, Beyonce has worked with and supported 31 charities, including Look to the Stars, Music Years, Stand Up to Cancer, and more. No wonder fans call her Queen B. Beyonce's car collection is surely going to blow your mind. Her incredible car collection is worth an astonishing $20 million, and it features Hot Wheels like the Rolls Royce Silver Cloud Convertible, an Alfa Romeo Spider, a Jeep Wrangler, a Cadillac Escalade, a Pagani Zonda 3 Colore, a Mercedes-Benz McLaren SLR, a Maybach Accelero, a Mercedes-Benz S-Class, a Porsche All Carrera Cabriolet, a Rolls-Royce Phantom, a Ferrari F430 Spider, a Range Rover Vogue, a Bentley Continental GT, a Maybach C2S, and a Tesla Model S. So this is the incredible lifestyle and income sources of Beyonce Knowles. Do you think any couple in the world can be this amazing lifestyle of the Carters? And if you ask me who are the most powerful and adorable family in the world, I will surely go for Beyonce, Jay-Z and their three little angels. Anyway, that's been me. Don't hesitate to share your thoughts on the comment section below. Also, don't forget to press the like button and subscribe if you are new here. Thanks for watching this one. Catch you in the next.